good one now. Yeah. <laughs> it's really good, uh, man. Hard to play. Alright? Yep. Uh, Chris Norris here, and I just want to tell you a little bit about what we're going to be doing with this uh, this fundraising campaign and, and what it's about, the, the reason behind it. Um, basically, so me and Ryan have this new band, and um, we have a lot of really cool material, a lot of stuff that we're really, really proud of. Hang on, what happened, man? That happened. Yeah, you did. It was me. So far, we've gotten together a couple times. I flew up to Richmond, uh, Virginia, where he lives. Uh, we also flew him down here to Florida where I currently live. Yeah, so basically Chris and I are just trying to get together in Richmond and in Florida, wherever, you know, whoever has time to travel to where, so that we can try to get these songs fully realized, fully developed, and then into the studio. I mean, we've had a few practices already where I've gone down to Florida and he's come up to Richmond and we've gotten a lot done, but the process is a lot harder when he's... He, Chris is a riff machine, man, so he'll just send me a ton of riffs and then I'll have all this information I'm trying to process and then we'll make calls back and forth trying to structure the songs. It's just, it's pandemonium. It just, it's really hard to work that way. We get it accomplished, but the songs that we have done that way are nowhere up to par with uh, the songs when we've actually gotten together in a, in a room and jammed and that's where all the magic kind of happens. You know, ho hopefully what we can do is, you know, get the funds we need so to, I can fly down there get a good like three or four days of rehearsal in and just really focus on the songs and then he can come up and do the same in Richmond. We really want to get this music recorded and out so we can start touring on this and start playing uh, out live again together. We're, we're such a tight knit, we're, we're playing together better than we ever have. You know, it takes time. It takes time to, to, to fully realize ideas. And uh, Chris's riffs are crazy. And it takes a lot of time to like focus and harness which, you know, which parts are needed, which parts are good. And when we figure it out, it's gonna be, it's gonna be awesome. We just need some help to, to make that happen. And hopefully any of you out there are as interested in hearing the music as we are in creating and playing this stuff. Basically, we're trying to get our idea out to the world the way that we hear it. And the way we wanna do that is we need to get into a studio. We're hoping that with this little drive that we can get the money we that we need to, to get in there and do that, as well as get to and from Florida and Virginia to have decent band practices. I mean, like full-on 12-hour days. We go big. Once we're in that, in that room, that's what we do. We just write and we write, and we don't stop until we come out of that room with something that we're really into. We've got to get face-to-face -face so that we can do it right. <laughs> We can have riffs all day long, but that's all they'll be, is riffs. And until we're in the room together writing the song, that's when it turns into the song. Old school Ryan and Chris, man. Just old school melodic death metal stuff that we've been doing since we were kids. Thanks a lot. We appreciate everything, man. And like, we, you know, thanks for having our backs. And uh, you know, we won't forget you. You know, we'll, you'll always be a part of something that we've uh, we've been trying to create. And we'll have a place in our hearts forever. So thanks so much for all your help. 